Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Saturday the 13th of January 2024. I hope you are keeping well and if you've just woken up like me, I hope you had a good night's sleep, much better than I did. Uh, mine was very fitful um, um, after some cats were fighting out, not my cat, some other cats were um, uh, weighing up for a fight uh, outside my bedroom window and they were screaming at each other before they started and I eventually had to get up and try and throw some water over them uh, but just the very fact of me going outside scared them off but it was uh, that was after a long time of uh, meowing and uh, found it difficult to go back to sleep after that and uh, so I figure well okay let's get up early on a Saturday and play the game of Sudoku as supplied by the Guardian. The Guardian is also reporting today a bit more about the um, Horizon scandal um, and that apparently um, Tony Blair was warned in a memo that the system had flaws but um, as Tony Blair being Tony Blair occasionally like to uh, just ignore fa uh, <laughs> facts that he thought were not expedient and uh, get on with it so um yeah there's that the uh, i mean it, it's become a big another issue it's become a big issue again since the tv drama was aired i mentioned it last week um but i mean it really shouldn't need television dramas for people to be concerned about events i mean it's such a long time ago that it was finished in 2015 was it such a long time ago and yet um it's still dragging on people still haven't been offered uh, proper compensation they haven't had their lives put back in order and you know lots of real cover-ups there i'm not conspiratory not conspiracy theory type cover-ups real cover-ups that are provable so um yeah it's an unfortunate situation. Let's hope those people really do get their lives back in order. They were so unfairly treated, those postmasters. Okay, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? Um, now, I saw, I saw something and my eyes dropped. Oh, yeah, there it is. I'm saying my eyes dropped it again. So this is Saturday, which means it's our Guardian Expert Level game. They give Once a week, they give us an Expert Level puzzle or what they define as an expert level puzzle. Sometimes it is pretty hard, sometimes it's not. We'll find out. We've got fives, there are threes here. That's the way to begin, three and five now. Across the middle. And we've got fives going up here as well. Five across here. Fives down this way. Five across here and down and down. And that's five out of the way for Saturday. Uh, we have two blocking across here and up there, so it's going to put two into one of those squares. Blocking across here, two blocking across here. There's a two.
All right, let's go through the digits uh, and see if I can spot anything um, easy to begin with. Okay, we've got 1 and 3 down here, so that's going to be 1 and 3 in those squares, and indeed we've got 3 blocking down here. So that will be our 3, and that will be our 1. I've spotted a pair as well. Okay, we've got 4 and 9 blocking across here. Right, so that puts four and nine somewhere in those squares, blocking back in this way, and four and nine blocking down here. So that's a pair of four and nine. So of these squares left, which can't be four or nine, we've got two blocking down here and two blocking down here, so that'd be a two. And these squares cannot be four or nine, they must be six or eight. which seems to be right. Uh, but I can't see which is which just yet. Um, now we can take that two and say two blocking up here and up here and across there. I'm going to I'm going to blue in some of the squares here because I keep this middle block here is confusing me there's definitely some restrictions here but I'm not sure exactly what they are okay we've got two blocking down here and two across there so two is in one of those squares blocking up here right now two blocks across there and so is in one of these two squares there blocking back there so that puts the two into that square Okay, three up here and up here puts a three into that square. Three across here, three up there and three across there gives us three in that square. And that's the final digit, three. Four up here puts four into one of these two squares, four blocking down here, four across there, and there's a four. Eight across here and there puts eight into that square. Nine going up here and nine across there means that's our nine. Nine down here, nine up there gives us a nine in that square. One more digit to go down here. Is it seven? It is. We've 
noisy outside again. It's noisy. Last night was noisy, and this morning's noisy outside. Lots of activity. Like I said, it feels like it's a holiday weekend. I don't think it is. No, it's not. In fact, I've got to start work on Monday properly. So um, it's kind of be a holiday. I think we might be at the stage where the easy ones are over, but I'm not sure exactly yet. So I'm going to go through once more and just give a final check to make sure the easy ones are over. No, the easy ones are not over. We've got nines blocking like this. So in the bottom row, there is a nine. And we have four blocking this square and this square. So this is going to be a four. Four up here, across there, and down there it gives us four in that square. Six blocks this square. We still need a six in this column, so there's the six. And the last number for this column is a seven. Seven across here, seven down there, and there's a seven. Seven across here, seven down there, there's a seven. And indeed, seven across here gives us seven in that square. Uh, we haven't got, why haven't we got them? Oh, yeah, down here, seven. Is that, yes, that was the last one. I think there are a few sixes and eight, or well, certainly a lot of some eights missing in places, which are holding me up here. Ah, there's one digit left here, which is a one. And now there's one digit over here, which is a six, I think. And the six blocking down here, we'll put the six here, and this is going to be an eight. I know, eight across here, eight across there, there's our eight. 
one and eight block down here, so that's one and eight here. So the missing number here is going to be six and six blocks down here. Or I could just look along and find the missing number, which is a six, six blocking across here. We're getting rid of all of those six and eights that I was um, concerned about slightly. Um, there you go. Missing digit here is a one. This must be an eight. This must be a one. And one blocks up here and up here and gives us a one there. One blocking across here puts one in this square. This will be our eight. And all of the eights are finally knocked out as well, I think. Yes. Okay, two blocks down here. So this wasn't an expert level game really, was it? And it's over now. I'm sure there's nothing to stop me from finishing this game uh, very quickly. So, um, yet another time when the Guardian promised an expert level. They didn't really deliver, but they do occasionally. You never can tell. Nine's here. The last number to get here is um, four, I think. Four blocks across there. There's our four. One is the last digit there. Uh, what are we looking for here? This is a four, I think. And up there is a six, and that's our expert level puzzle, or not very expert level puzzle, over for a Saturday. And uh, I've got a lot of things to do today, but I should try to fit in a game of Sudoku here and there. Bye-bye.